Emmanuel Macron has given Britain and Jersey a two-week deadline to give French fishermen greater access to UK waters. Anik Jaradan, France's maritime minister, gave Britain up until November 1 to approve more licenses or risk retaliatory measures. Her comments came during a tense meeting with the European Commission and representatives from the French fishing industry. French President Mr. Macron told his government to draw up plans for reprisals against Britain in four areas. These include cutting energy supplies to the UK and Jersey or severe the Anglo-French ties in defence and security, The Telegraph reported. Ms. Gerardin reportedly told Maro Safkovic, the EU Commission Vice President, the Paris could strike if Britain or Jersey did not grant more licences. This comes after the UK approved just 12 permits out of 47 applications for small French fishing boats. Despite relying on France for 95% of its electricity supply, Jersey has also taken a hard stance against EU trawlermen off its coast. It issued just 66 full licenses and 31 temporary permits and refused 73 applications. Now EU boats have until the end of October to provide the data needed to prove their post-Brexit right to fish in the Channel Islands waters. A source said Ms. Gerardan told the commissioners she is preparing, with colleagues from other ministries, response measures that France can implement from November 1 if necessary, Ms. Gerardan told reporters after the meeting. We are two weeks away from this Jersey decision. Nothing has been ruled out today, neither by France nor by the European Commission. Leading representatives from the French fishing industry demanded Brussels walks out of the talks and hit Britain with retaliatory measures. Gérard Romitti, the president of France's National Committee of Fisheries and Aquaculture, said, We are tired of this bad faith shown by the United Kingdom in the implementation of the agreement, and more particularly in the issuance of access to the 6-12 to mile fishing zones. Queen Margrethe II to bring Karen Blixen's image creating worlds to life in Netflix film.